Welcome back. Now let's make some beans. I used to make beans in an olla, which is also called a pot on the stove top. I had to watch the water levels and refill constantly. There was also the chore of overnight soaking, which the chore mentioned was actually my thinking well enough ahead to prep the beans. But once I got the Instapot, I fell in love with it after just making this one dish. Cuts time from prep and in the cooking, which means I can at last have beans with the last minute meal. Here I'm just using really hot water to clean off the beans. I'm looking for any clumps of dirt or any abnormal looking beans. A kernel of corn. My Instapot is an eight quart. So with those five cups of raw beans, I will then just fill up that bowl until it's max level. Add one stick of salted butter and this salt I want to guess it's between a fourth and an eighth cup is what I ended up adding from that I usually don't do any measurements so I'm trying to guess as close as I can The Instapot settings is on high pressure cook at 120. Once the pressure builds up, then the timer will start going off. Once the beans are done, I then put in pico de gallo. So if you already have some already made, I usually use about three to four tablespoons. I did not have any regular sized tomatoes, so I ended up just using what I had. I did leave the seeds in the jalapenos and I ended up using about a fourth of that onion. Ugh, that was not my onion day. Once the beans are done, just put in your pico de gallo. You can either shut the lid back on it or serve immediately. Hope you enjoy this. Let me know if you make it. Comment below.